Greetings gamers and welcome to another Lasercorn channel video, another Q&A video. This is Q&A 2018. We've got the sword. We always have the sword for Q&A. Sometimes we have paper questions that we pretend to cut, but I don't have any of those this time. So the sword's just kind of there for looks. Um, all right, uh, so right off the bat, uh, I wanted to take a minute and answer a question I get a lot. It's like, hey, Lasercorn, are you ever gonna come to blank? It's like uh, Australia or blah, 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 or Canada. Hey, speaking of Canada, yes, I am. Uh, in fact, I'm going to a bunch of different places on kind of a, uh, a fan expo tour. And I've listed all of these places. I'm gonna pop them on screen right now. But the very first place this weekend, I'm gonna be in Canada for the Calgary Expo. And I'm really psyched about it. It's gonna be really cool. There's a link in the description. If you're gonna be in that area, if you wanna travel to that area and meet me and hang out and do some cool stuff, uh, go ahead and click the link in that description and you'll get more information on that. So yeah, I would look forward to seeing you there if you are there. Uh, it's gonna be me and Jovenshire and Wes and Sohinki. It's gonna be a blast, we're gonna have a lot of fun. I've never been to Calgary, so I'm really looking forward to it. Maybe one of you guys out there can take me out and show me the town. Next question I've been seeing a lot. Hey Lasercorn, are you doing uh, summer games? I have no idea. Uh, if they hit me up about it, of course, I would love to go. Uh, but I haven't been hit up about it, and if you remember correctly, uh, they didn't do a Winter Games. So yeah, I have no idea whether it's happening, whether I'm going or not. Uh, I will give you that information. The best thing to do is just follow the Smosh Games uh, YouTube channel. I'm sure if, if it is happening, they'll do an announcement about it. Uh, but yeah, uh, and if I'm invited, I will definitely tweet out, hey, I'm gonna be doing this. So just yeah, follow the Twitters, follow the, follow the page, and, uh, and as soon as that information becomes public, you'll know about it. But I have no inside intel on that. So sorry, I wish I could be more helpful. And then the third kind of general question I wanted to get out of the way before we get into the Twitter specific questions is uh, where, where have you been? Like there hasn't been much content on this channel. Yeah, yeah I know. Uh, and the honest answer to that is paying the bills. I've been doing uh, stuff to generate money, uh, which YouTube, uh, you know, is kind of hit or miss sometimes lately with all the de demonetization and stuff. And uh, yeah, I've been trying to do that, uh, focus on the things that are bringing in income. You know, I got a family to support. I have a wife and child and uh, and you know it costs money to send Tyler to daycare and stuff and you know support support the fam and living expenses in LA uh, not cheap so uh, paying those bills but I haven't been gone from the internet you know I'm over on Toaster Ghost we put up like four videos a week so I'm in all of those pretty much and then on Smosh Games I did a Mari Craft run and then I did Smosh and Order and then I did I don't know if it'll be out at the time of this video but I did a, a board AF with them, so I'm over there. I'm doing stuff over on Nerds with Kids, and on Facebook, I'm streaming like a lot, like three or four weekdays a week, and then posting some videos there. So I'm still doing stuff, and there'll be a link to my Facebook page in the description too if you wanna check that out, because there's a lot more laser corn content there. But uh, I'm not gone from YouTube forever. I'm taking a slight break while I, while I get some stuff sorted out and get these bills paid, but I'm coming back. I got ideas for stuff I wanna do here. Um, and when I come back, I want to come back strong with like a consistent stream of videos, and I'm just not there yet. So, uh, working that out, but I'll be back soon. All right, let's get into some specific questions. I asked on, on Twitter, do you have any questions for me? And some people answered. So we got uh, Fa Mimi Ru says, who is your biggest inspiration in life? Uh, right now, that'd be my parents, uh, because I'm trying to you know raise a three-year-old, and it's a lot of work, and it's, it's huge reward, but it's a lot of work, and I'm trying to be a good dad, and. You know, it's hard, and I hope that I'm, I'm doing half the job they did, but right now I'm, I'm finding myself thinking a lot, man, how were my parents such good parents all the time and also able to like take care of me and get everything taken care of? Because, you know, I, I have such great memories. My dad built a, a box fort out of all the cardboard boxes from moving when we moved into our first house, and my mom used to make me, you know, homemade Halloween costumes every year. We were Scorpion and Sub-Zero one year. I was Sub-Zero because Sub-Zero is better. My brother was Scorpion. Um, but uh, yeah, they were really great parents and uh, really trying to just live up to that right now. So they would be my inspiration at the moment. Uh, we got Sansley Parzival Johnson says, do you think your life would have been different if you won that cage match against Ohinki and never had to dye your hair orange in the first place? Nah, I was already kind of thinking of dyeing my hair orange. I kind of threw that match. If you watch closely, I was way up. And I'm like, oh no, I'm losing. Dedicated Toolbox says, if you were a vehicle, what kind of vehicle would you be? That's a damn good question. Probably Sweet Tooth's ice cream truck from Twisted Metal. I've already got the hair. Kira says, do you think there will ever be a Half-Life 3? No, just give up on it. And then if there is, you'll be pleasantly surprised. Sarah says, what are your favorite bonding moments with Tyler? 
Uh, so I was actually the one who was there. Don't tell my wife this. She doesn't usually watch this channel. I'm pretty sure I was the one who was there when Tyler took his first steps. I remember it was at our old apartment and I saw him hanging onto the couch and he hadn't really taken any steps yet. And I'm just like, come here, buddy, come here. And he goes, ah, yeah. And he kind of toddles over to me and like falls into my arms and goes, ah. And I'm like, good, awesome, do it again. And then, so on the second or third day of us playing this game, my wife uh, came in, walked in on us kind of doing it. And she's like, is he walking? Is he taking steps right now? And I'm like, oh yeah, you just caught the very first ones. Oh my God, look at what's happening. But that was kind of my favorite bonding moment. We kind of had a secret walking session. Uh, also, other fun bonding moments. Uh, we played mini golf. I played a mini round of mini golf with him just strapped to my back. Yeah, those are our, those are our big bonding moments. Uh, Jennifer Five Days says, "Why are you so damn adorable?" Uh, <laughs> I, I don't know. I guess I was born this way. By the way, Mom, thanks for making a fake account uh, as Jennifer Five Days and and making me feel good about myself. I know it's you. I know it's you, Mom. I am adorable. D W K F R L says, "Would you rather go to one?" fictional universe of your choice or have that universe blend with ours uh that would depend if it were a one-time trip i'd definitely take the one-time trip if it were i had to go and live there permanently uh and could never come back no i'd say just blend it and then uh the universe i would blend with this one oof what universe would i want i don't know maybe the witcher universe <laughs> i liked witcher 3 i could probably take out a troll if it came down to it, me and a troll one on one, get that uh, decoction, that uh, that regeneration decoction, basically be Wolverine. Yeah, we'll, we'll go with the Witcher. Seth Murray says, "When is the at Toaster Ghost at Smosh Games crossover happening? Whenever they want, bring it, son. We'll rip them apart." I don't know. Hit them up. Ask. <laughs> Andy Hike says, "Where's my dad?" Uh, I I don't know, man. I'm sorry. Dragonite55 says, if you could have a rideable pet that you can summon any time, what would the pet be? Channing Tatum. Quan Yu says, who would you take from Smosh Games Smosh Squad if you were deserted on an island? Quan Yu says, uh, who would you take from Smosh Games Smosh Squad if you were deserted on an island? Honestly, probably Mari. She was on Survivor, right? She had to have picked up some survival in the wild tricks while she was there. Uh, there's no way that, that I'm dying if I have Mari with me. I feel like she could maybe build a fire or wrestle an alligator or something, keep me safe and uh, and get me out of there, out of that deserted island alive. Cross Games says, do you still play Dota 2? If not, what game do you play most at the moment? I do not play Dota 2 anymore, sadly. Uh, I just haven't played in a long time and I'm scared because I know they overhauled the game a lot and made a lot of changes uh, to the core game mechanics. So I'm not sure I could still even, my mind could still absorb it. I, I still think it's a great game, but I'm not entirely sure I could uh, get out there and be any use to a team. What games am I playing most at the moment? PUBG, a uh, very frustrating game. I mostly try to run people over because I just, it, that's what brings me the most joy in that game. Uh, playing a lot of Overwatch, love Overwatch, love and Bridget, can't wait till she gets introduced to competitive play. Uh, you know, I'm playing a little bit of Breath of the Wild still, still haven't beat that. Just whenever I get a free moment, I try and crank some of that out. Oh, the new game Maelstrom, uh, great pirate game, me and Sohinky have been tag teaming that really like it so those are the games I'm playing right now thanks for thanks for asking all right guys thank you thank you so much for all of these questions uh, this has been a blast more content coming soon uh, please check out the uh, the fan expo tour we're doing all those dates and check out especially Calgary in the in the description if you're gonna be there uh, I would love to see you all there and uh, thanks for watching and I'll see you next time